Let's get things underway with your first fight. This, an amateur contest over two three minute rounds. The first of your two contestants fighting out of the red corner. Would you welcome Rosa Wickham? And introducing her opponent, fighting out of the blue corner, Steph Thomas. So a very good evening to you, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the uprising. It is great to be with you. I am Chris Hookstra, joined alongside. Dean Minat tonight. Dean, what a way to start things off. We've got amateur fighters, we've got semi-pros, and of course the professional ranks. Rosa Wickham taking on Steph Thomas. A very tricky grappler is the talk of the locker room. Thomas going for that arm bar. Yeah, Thomas trying to secure the arm bar from the ground, Chris, but she's got control of the head of Rose. Rose is doing a great job trying to suck her arm out there. She's gonna posture up now and look to get on top. Rosa able to kind of clear the elbow there, catches a good early escape. Looking for that outside, double leg, neck in jeopardy. Rose now cinched up the guillotine, she's got the arm in, but what she needs to do is make sure her shoulder's high, Chris, and turn the clock to finish that choke. Body punches here from Steph. She's got to think about hand fighting there, Chris, and start to work her way out of this choke. So a good early couple of submission opportunities, equal opportunity here. Now, Rosa Wickham looking for that guillotine gonna be difficult to get at this point. Her opponent, Steph Thomas, is out. Looking to posture up and pass. That step was very calm and collected. She's dropping down for a leg lock, Chris. It looks like a straight Achilles, but she was very calm on the fire, worked her way out of the guillotine now. Oh, she gave up the mount. Now Rose, full mount in position, Chris. This is dangerous. Yeah, Rosa did very well there to counter and escape, clearing the knee line. Now she's going for that spinning arm bar, Dean. She's on the bottom now, she needs to control the head, so flare her right leg out. Or perhaps go even belly down, Chris, and extend the arm out. But Steph doing a great job of keeping heavy. She's protecting her arm. She needs to jump round to her left side, Chris, over the body of Rosa. Back and forth, as expected. Great matchmaking here. That was really one of the key things coming into this, Dean. Oh, no, she's got that hyperextension. Can she get the submission there? That's it. Daniel Movahidi steps in. A technical submission win. And that's what she did, a great job. She didn't have to go belly down. She actually did an armbar that you'd see evident of Ronda Rousey does. She, what she'll do is she'll cinch up the arm, she'll keep the legs nice and tight, she'll face off to her left and extend the arm. Beautiful work here by Rosa. All right, Hastings, what a great way to start things off. We're gonna continue here. We're not going to continue. I thought for some reason we we're going to continue. Wow. One more time, would you please make some noise for Wickham. Rosa Wickham via submission and, of course, a very game Steph Thomas. That was a great early contest, folks. So, ladies and gentlemen, after just one round of action, referee in charge, Daniel Movihidi has called a stop to this contest, declaring your winner via technical submission due to an armbar, it's Rosa Wickham. Please, one more time for Steph Thomas. Both ladies exchanging armbars, that was beautiful stuff.